Good morning and welcome to the third Asia Pacific Prada Willy Syndrome Conference. My name is sorry. My name is Tim Percival and I'm the president of the Prada Willy Association of Victoria Incorporated. On behalf of the Australian and New Zealand Prada Willy Syndrome Associations, it's an honour to be hosting this event in Melbourne, Victoria. I'd like to thank uh, a number of people and I'll go through uh, from the presenters uh, to start with. I'd like to thank all the doctors, scientists, researchers, professionals and parents who are presenting over the next few days, um, coming from all over the globe, including Australia, New Zealand, England, Sweden, America, Italy and Japan. Many of whom I know personally, such as Dr Margaret Rao, my seven-year-old son's um, PWS doctor since birth, and Dr Gillian Nixon, who's my son's respiratory doctor at Monash Hospital. Um, I just want to add a little bit of uh, my own thoughts in here. My most memorable experience with uh, Jill Nixon was coordinating via sal satellite phone from the middle of the Pacific Ocean for a BiPAP machine to be flown from Sydney to our ship when it docked in Fiji. That was a bit of an adventure and everything worked out well. Uh, I would also like to thank the organisers. Um, the conference of this size requires an enormous amount of planning and organising and a big thank you to the conference committee members being Georgina Lochnan from New South Wales, Tessa Maguire from Victoria, Karen O'Reilly from New Zealand, Anne and Ray Sakaris from Tasmania and Boone Walker from Victoria. Please join me in showing our appreciation for their tireless efforts. <laughs> I'd also like to thank our sponsors for whom without this event would not be possible. Our gold sponsors, Interaction New South Wales and Pfizer Australia. <laughs> Silver sponsors, Prada Willy Syndrome Associations of New Zealand, Victoria, New South Wales and Australia. <laughs> and our bronze sponsors, Optia Tasmania and the Prada Willy Syndrome Association of Queensland. Thank you. <laughs> also like to thank our volunteer sponsors, um, Bubble Advertising, Robin Maguire, who's been responsible for the logo design, website, booklet and all of the other conference materials. Mule Print, uh, who have uh, organised the booklets and posters and the Rotary Club of Doncaster who are out there manning the desk and uh, providing volunteers, so thank you very much to them. Um, we've got a jam-packed program with something for all. Uh, day one is a medical side of PWS including hormone treatments, genetics, sleep disorders, obesity and research surrounding the brain, as well as re other research into Prader-Willi syndrome. Day two concentrates on management of, Peter, of those with PWS. You'll hear from those with PWS, those that care for those with PWS, family members of PWS, including siblings and professionals. They will discuss the day-to-day -day of PWS, including diet and food management, exercise, social skills, schooling, the transition from children to adults and housing and accommodation. 10D numbers, it's fantastic to see so many people attending the conference this weekend. I'm told we were expecting 140 and we ended up with 240 registrations, so that's uh, fantastic. Go Orange. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I'd just like to mention Go Orange. I've got the Go Orange um, uh, ribbon here. Um, as many of you are aware, 29th of May is Go Orange Day for PWS. Um, this day, including the lead up to, to the day for the month of May, raises a lot of awareness and much needed funds for PWS. The um, campaign has grown year on year and this year should be no exception. As well as raising awareness, the campaign also raises much needed funds for PWS organisations. Um, this year the Victorian Association has invested in an online store, um, making it easier to purchase merchandise, join in or establish orange fundraising and awareness activities and make donations. Um, there's a number of different initiatives, the 1515 campaign, which if you get on and have a look, that'll be uh, it's quite easy to raise funds, um, so that we're looking forward to that. The online store can be found at www.go-orange.org.au. Uh, there's also a Go Orange store here at the conference selling merchandise and providing information. The website's got a few issues at the moment, but it should be up and fully running in the next week or two. It's up now, but it's just, just uh, acquiring the merchandise is a little bit tricky. Um, once again, thanks to all for your attendance and I'm sure each and every one of you will get a lot out, out of the next few days. I would now like to introduce Tessa Maguire, <coughs> excuse me, Vice President of the PWS Association of Victoria, one of the organisers of this conference who will provide information with regard to housekeeping, etc. Thank you. Thanks, Tim. Okay. 
My name is Tessa Maguire and I'm a Facebookaholic. <laughs> I, I, w I'm, I don't post things of uh, selfies of myself and I don't post pictures of my food, but I go on there to um, get in contact with other people with Prada, other families with Prada Willie and um, talk about things that only we understand. I want to tell you a couple of the things that uh, parents only will understand these sort of things. Um, have you ever told somebody that your child has diabetes because PWS is just too hard to explain? Have you ever told your, anyone that your child has autism because PWS is too hard to explain? Have you ever taken your child to school in pyjamas just because he just won't get dressed? <laughs> um, have you gotten death stares from other women in the women change rooms because you've taken your 12 year old son in there? Um, have you ever been told just one lolly won't hurt. Have you been to a GP who says, yeah, I know all about PWS, and then proceeds to tell you he's okay, bring him back if he vomits, he has a temperature, or is off his food? <laughs> Have you ever locked your pantry with your child in it? <laughs> <clears throat> Have you ever told somebody about the food issues and they laugh and say, yeah, I've got a bit of PWS myself. Have you ever heard your daughter say, I want to eat bananas in pyjamas? <laughs> Have you ever bought your son, your adult son, a toy gun and then proceeded to walk through airport security? <laughs> no. Um, so if you're not on Facebook, get on it just to get in contact with other parents. It's just, it helped me a lot and I'm sure it will help a lot of people too. So I'm just here to um, tell you about the housekeeping stuff. If you've got your phone, actually, turn your phones off, yes. Um, your lanyards have to be worn at all times and you might be asked why you don't have it. Um, unfortunately, Tony Holland um, can't be with us for the conference. Um, he was due to speak three times, so we've sort of juggled the conference a bit, so you, the program a bit, so you will have an insert in your program with the new program. Hasn't changed that much, but yeah. Um, we've, there's an evaluation form in your booklet, and it's quite long, so we want your opinion on every session. So could you please fill it out as you go? Otherwise, you'll forget what I said. <laughs> um, we're on a very tight schedule, so please come back at exactly the times on the schedule. Um, we've had so many people wanting to talk and we've had to knock a few people back. So we've jam-packed it in, so please um, let's stay on time. Um, save your questions to the end if there's time in each session. Otherwise, write it down and there's a question box at the registration desk and we'll get back to it at the panel at the end. Um, teas and lunches will be in the foyer or in 42nd Street room, which is just across there. Um, toilets are down this hall to the left over that way. Um, what else? Okay, so at the end of today at 5.45, um, the Prada Willy Association of Australia will be holding a general meeting. Um, anybody who is from Australia, you don't even have to be a member, just go into the phantom room at the end of today's sessions um, and you can voice your concerns or raise any issues that you want um, Prada Willy Australia, which is our national body, um, to think about. <laughs> um, and yeah, so everybody's got their bags. Inside, their, inside your bag, there's a notepad can we, everybody take out your notepad and a pen and your pen, write down your name on your notepad, flick that up and put it at the front so we know whose bag it is because everyone's going to leave their bags lying around. Um, do it, James. <laughs> um, and just put it, in, write your name, big letters, put it in the front. So if we pick up a bag, we know whose it is. Because we've only got just enough bags for everyone, so don't take another one. <laughs> um, and in tomorrow's session, tomorrow at um, 
when we have the breakout session for the adult session and the children's session. The children's session will be here and the adult session will be in the phantom room. And so with Go Orange, um, to, Tim's already mentioned all that, but um, we'd like to just leave you with the video that we had made up. Um, and it's pretty hard to hear some things, so we'll just be really quiet and put it on. Thank you, David. I want to go back to Orlando. Like picked up when I was that. in a cafe shop. Oh. And I am pink car. You want to drive a pink car? And the phone. I would like to be a pet shop keeper and look up at the animals in the shop and pay money at the counter. When I grow up, I want to work with animals. I'd like to be a teacher when I grow up. When I grow up, I want to become a teacher. I want to live in the house by myself in Brisbane. I want to study science in college. Yeah. I want to be a zookeeper with a when I grow up. And I want to get married and have babies. I'm a garbage man. Oh, I love you, I love you.